From the Tennessee Valley Weather Channel, this is your evening update. Pretty nice weekend so far, at least the end of our weekend has been pretty decent. Those clouds have moved out of here, but it's been cool, right? We were in the upper 50s and lower 60s, so sure, it was pretty clear through the last half of today, but I'll tell you what, it was kind of brisk out there, right? We had that wind out of the north, those temperatures are really taking a nosedive, but we'll be back to spring here in due time. Futurecast paints the picture pretty nicely. There's that wind out of the north that's kind of made things a little bit brisk out there. And of course, we have that frost advisory in southern middle Tennessee and northeast Mississippi. And here's why. Notice those temperatures getting down to the lower to mid 30s across the area, especially on the north side of the state line, right? So it's no surprise that we have that. But we get back to the 60s, even some mid to upper 60s for tomorrow. I think on average, we'll probably run around 65, 66 degrees for our Monday. And then through Tuesday, Wednesday, and beyond, well, we actually really get back to the 70s, maybe even some 80s returning by the end of the week. Here's a first impulse coming in. That's going to be dragging south through about Wednesday. Very, very isolated shower chances. Notice as it drags south, the moisture just kind of gets starved. It really doesn't look very impressive here. But as we head through Thursday through Friday, a little bit more decent rain chances creeping in as that system continues to manifest across the southeast. Here's your hometown forecast for tonight. There are those kind of right in the frost range temperatures, mid 30s, maybe some lower 30s here in southern middle Tennessee. Hopping across the state line though, I really don't think it's going to be that big of a deal. Down here, upper 30s, right near 40 is going to be the story, especially along its south of the river there. So I think it really is going to be a southern middle Tennessee issue for that frost. Now over the next couple of days, looking pretty decent out there. Clouds building through the week though, temperatures increasing. Isolated chances there through the end portions of the week in the first half of next weekend. So that's what we were talking about with that slightly more active pattern. So we'll keep a close eye on that. You saw in the future cast though, it didn't look particularly robust, but of course models can and will change. So we'll keep you updated to see how it evolves. Thanks for joining me here for this forecast update at six. Of course, I'll be back with you at nine for a final look at your weekend weather fresh from Tennessee Valley Weather Center. I'll speak to you then.